Hello, my name is Avalyn Beeman, and tonight I'm going to be raising Bloody Mary. Um, before I did, I thought I'd learn to uh, speak with a friend of mine who's supposedly your, was it your younger, your younger brother? Or younger your, sister. Your younger sister. She, she brought Bloody Mary or something like that, so I was kind of interested to... Uh, what what exactly happened? I mean, were the parents there or? Well, my my dad was in his room and my sister was in her room, which has its own separate little bathroom. Oh, I see. And she had a friend spend the night with her, and uh, they went into the bathroom, and uh, they did some kind of uh, incantation or something uh, along those lines. And uh, probably about uh, five minutes after I walked out of the room, I was in the kitchen doing dishes, and she ran up to me. She had blood across her face. Welts oh about a quarter of an inch off of her skin. Oh her shirt was ripped open. Um, so, and then, uh, uh, do you, did you ever room. find out what exactly oh. they did in the bathroom or to raise her? Well, my sister described a, I guess you could call it an incantation. I guess that's what you would say that she did. Mm -hmm. um, she stood in front of the mirror, uh, looking at it in her eye to eye, and eye to she eye. right, and she did three circles. Standing still, kind of spinning. Like a 360. Right, exactly. So she looks in the mirror eye to eye and says Bloody Mary three times and then turns right. around. Right, and then turns around three times. Then okay. she does it, looks in the mirror again, eye to eye, and she says, Bloody Mary, I've got your baby. Okay. Right? After she does that, she stands in front of, she does three more, she does another 360, mm -hmm. then she looks in the mirror again, she says, Bloody Mary, I've got a knife. Then she does one more set of 360s and she says, Bloody Mary, I've got your baby. And I'm going to cut it. Okay, I see. So, basically, she looks at the mirror and says, Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary. Turns around three times and says, um, I've got your baby. Right. Turns around three more times and says, I've got a knife. Right. Turns around three more times and says, I've got your baby and I'm going to cut it. That's correct. Okay, I see. Now you address her each time that you look in the mirror, you address her as Bloody Mary. Okay. So, um, did she have any sort of, uh, like, uh, candles or anything she needed to... Not, not that I found in the bathroom when I went in there and checked it out. Alright. Let's try this. Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary. Bloody Mary, I've got your baby. Bloody Mary, I've got a knife. Bloody Mary, I've got your baby and I'm gonna cut it. Hello? Uh, hello? Nothing. Just as I thought. Welcome back. I'm George Ernwine and this is a friend of mine. And uh, unfortunately, Bloody Mary has been proven not to exist. Tell me what happened. Well, I just, uh, I went to the bathroom, locked the door, and uh, I did pretty much what you told me. I let my eyes adjust, of course, to the darkness. And I just kind of looked into the mirror and uh, said what you told me. Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary. Bloody Mary, I've got your baby. Bloody Mary, I've got a knife. Bloody Mary, I've got your baby. And I'm going to cut it. Just sort of waited for a minute, and it's really odd because I didn't hear a response. So I you didn't see anything? No, not that I remember. Did you hear anything? No, sir. Mm. Feel anything? Um, not really. Um, I wasn't really expecting anything. I'm not exactly a believer. Right. So I just kind of, you know, it's kind of fun, I guess. You right. Know? Did you feel any uh, anxieties, any fears, any any precognitive? 
uh, feelings with you before you walked in the door? Did you feel anything? Um, I'd say maybe just a small little amount, but uh, I was pretty confident that nothing would happen. So right. It's not really well, that's good that you have confidence. Thank you. Um, well, let's see here. Did you uh, did you experience any uh, anything inside the bathroom at all, other than the fact that it was dark in a bathroom, and that's it? Shadows or anything like that. Uh, no, not not really. I mean, it was dark, so there might have been something, but I didn't see anything, didn't hear anything. So it's not. I mean, nothing came to get me. Right. As right. you can see, I've got no. Uh, yeah, it looks like you don't no have welts. any welts or bruises or no, no damage done to you whatsoever. No. Well, that's it, ladies and gentlemen. The bathroom's ghostless. Looks like Buddy Mary only visits once a month. That's it. It's good to be a friend. Good to be a friend too. And uh, you can also buy her a boat.